Hello everyone, my name is Lata Krishnan. We are witnessing an unprecedented time in our global history and in our individual lives. And on behalf of all of us at AIF, we hope that you and your loved ones stay safe and healthy during this time. As you've probably heard already, the AIF Gala, which is the largest and only fundraiser in our community, has been canceled. However, our wonderful team in India and the US has put together a first ever animation on the work that we do in India. And frankly, none of what we do in India, none of what we do at AIF would be possible without each and every one of your support. So a very sincere and deeply grateful thank you to all of you. This shall be followed by remarks from Mr. Vivek Ranadev, who is not only a tech tycoon and visionary, but he's the first Indian American to own an NBA team, and most importantly, is a philanthropist. And finally, you'll hear from a very, very special individual from India, who obviously could not be here personally, but has sent her remarks by video, and she is an individual whose life you, and I mean you, have completely changed. Thank you. Choosing a charity is complicated. You want to ensure that your donations are going to a truly important cause, that your money is being used wisely, with most of your donation actually being used in the pursuit of their mission, not to run the organization. The American India Foundation, or AIF, is proud to be in the top 1% of charities where contributions go directly towards programs producing tangible social impact. For us, that social impact can be seen in how we've improved the lives of nearly 6 million of India's poor. We were founded in 2001 at the initiative of President Bill Clinton and Indian Prime Minister Vajpayee. For two decades, we've been proud to provide access to high-quality education, formal sector employment for urban youth and people with disabilities, and public health services to protect mothers and infants, all the while building the next generation of global leaders through service. While we address these core issues on a regional, country and international scale, the deep impact of our work is felt directly across 24 states of India. We tackle poverty in India building on three pillars, education, livelihoods and health, because the strongest platforms are built on the most solid foundations. This multi-pronged approach reflects the most basic and immediate needs of the poor in India. Almost 140 million people annually migrate in search of work. LAMP, the Learning and Migration Program, provides educational opportunities and shelter to children of families impacted. And DE, our Digital Equalizer Program, improves learning outcomes of children in public schools where 60% lack basic computing technology. We impact livelihoods through MAST, our market-aligned skills training for India's unemployed youth. And ABLE, our ability-based livelihood empowerment program, which works to ensure that people with disabilities are able to obtain equal, inclusive and dignified livelihoods. Nearly a quarter of all infant deaths worldwide occur in India, which is why MANSI, our maternal and newborn survival initiative, forms the basis of our healthcare program. Through Mansi, we equip some of the poorest and most remote states in India with trained community health workers to help dramatically reduce newborn mortality. Over the next five years, we'll invest $100 million to expand our impact across these initiatives and others, reduce preventable newborn mortality by 50%, make 5,000 ultra-poor villages child migration free, skill 100,000 underprivileged youth, and with your help, much, much more. Imagine $800 can save a baby's life. $2,000 can fund a basic computer lab. And a mere $25 can fund a child's education for an entire year. Your donation to AIF directly impacts the daily lives of millions of families, women, and children across India. Your engagement matters. Your investment matters. What you do today matters. Please consider supporting a regional program today at www.aif.org slash donate.
So some of us have been very lucky in the lives that we've been able to lead. And uh, with that luck comes uh, responsibility. I grew up in uh, Bombay, India. I grew up in a beautiful house by the beach and I had a fantastic childhood. Uh, but when you get older, you look back on your life and you start thinking about, was there one experience that shaped who I was? Uh, and for me, that happened when I was a little boy in, in, in Bombay. Uh, and I had my ear plastered to a little transistor radio. And I heard these magical words, one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Uh, I was listening to the Voice of America broadcast the moon landing live all the way to Bombay. And I thought to myself, wow, uh, who are these people that were able to take a man, put him in a box, and send him 250,000 miles away to land on a rock flawlessly the very first time? What imagination, what brilliance, what courage. Uh, and I said, you know what, I want to be one of them. So that was the pivotal defining moment of my life because it was when I decided I was going to get serious about my studies and I was going to somehow, some way, make my way to America. And I applied to this place called MIT and they made a mistake in the admissions process, admitted me, uh, and uh, so it had always been my dream uh, to go to MIT and uh, I was able to make that dream come true. What made uh, MIT and the whole American experience uh, different and unique was there was a sense of possibility. The sky was the limit. Uh, there was nothing that was holding you back and there was no other place uh, like that other than America. I'm one of these guys who wakes up every morning and my first thought is, is gratitude uh, and then after that I'm thinking what can I do uh, to have an impact? What can I do uh, to make the world better or even a, a person's life better. In Silicon Valley, people often talk about investing in, in unicorns. And when I think of what AIF has done and what Lata has done, really she's the ultimate social unicorn. We're not looking at will the company worth, be worth a billion. We're looking at can we have an impact on the lives of a billion people. When we had an opportunity to help schools uh, put computers and, and basketball courts and uh, give kids in low-income schools, uh, the same kinds of opportunities that kids in the U.S. have, uh, we, we jumped at that chance. And that, of course, was thanks uh, to the work of AIF. I recently had uh, what can only be uh, described as the most, one of the most epic experiences of my life. Uh, I got to uh, see a dream come true when I was able to take my team, the Sacramento Kings, to my hometown uh, of Bombay, uh, and they were watched by 70 million people. Uh, so this was, for me, a epic moment in my life. And uh, just think about it, I left uh, Bombay with $50 in my pocket, and then one day I show up there with my own NBA team. But the thing that left uh, a mark, was just etched into my soul, is when I was able to walk into one of the five schools uh, that we had helped uh, fund uh, computer labs and, and basketball courts for. And when I saw the kids in that school, and I saw uh, how excited they were and what this meant to them, this is one of those moments that is just etched into my soul. I will, I will never forget that. AIF is an incredible organization, and of course it has an incredible entrepreneur, visionary uh, at its helm. And I'm so very grateful to, to Lata and uh, AIF uh, that I had this opportunity to, to do this and to see these kids uh, and to have that experience. So thank you, AIF. I just wanted to throw out a challenge uh, to all of you, and I know you guys have done amazing things with your lives and you continue to be very generous. But what we did in Bombay is very small. It was just for a handful of schools, and it's a, it's a robotics or a computer lab and a basketball court. Uh, and the philosophy being uh, work, work your mind and also work your body. But here's the thing. there's almost two million other schools in India. So let's figure out a way that we can put a robotics computer lab and a basketball court in each and every one of those schools. Let's do it.
my name is Pooja Vijay Upadhyay. In my family, there are four members: my mother, my father, my brother, and myself. I used to go to lot of giving lot of interview to different different organization, normal organization. Then there were a lot of rejections. The best part of it, they give us training. They judge the able, differently able people of what they are able to do, and then accordingly they schedule in an organization of what we are capable of doing. Oh, pura, ham log ne sab test karwaya. Tabhi se pata chala ke puja cerebral palsy hai actually. Lekin ham log dare nahi. Ham log ne socha ke aaj jo situation hai, usme se ham log ko puja ko bari nikalne ka hai. तो हम लोग तभी भी डरे नहीं थे और आज हम लोग देख ही रहे कि कुछ वक्त के बाद आज 29 इयर्स के बाद में आज पूजा की जो सिचुएशन है और पहले की पूजा को देखेंगे तो कोई बिलीव नहीं करेगा ए का ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम है हम तो वहाँ पे उसने जो ट्रेनिंग लिया है तो वहीं से उसको अच्छी ट्रेनिंग मिली मोटिवेशन मिला उसकी वजह से वापिस पूजा का दूसरा जन्म हुआ है एक्चुअली आज बोले तो और वहीं से उसका बहुत अच्छा प्रोग्रेस भी हुआ है। So I drive from my place to Villepalle East, which is my office. So 15 to 20 minutes it takes for me to reach from my place to the office destination. So I handle customer query, customer relationship, relationship working as a relationship manager also. I like to communicate. Basically my I am good at communication, so I want to improve much and more about how best way I can handle customers and develop more and more confidence so my work is moving on, you know, in a better way. I would like to thank for AIF for giving me the right platform today where I am I wouldn't have been she can talk English she can talk Gujarati she can talk Marathi she can talk all various languages that was a added advantage she was very confident in replying to customers Currently, as on date, she's managing two different platforms with two different knowledge set altogether and customer base He is very good at talking to customers and that is what is needed in customer service. There is no special privileges to her or something. Basically what matters to us is the work that she does and that work she is perfect at it. So Wasn't Pooja just so inspiring? There are so many like her in India today. Children and women who are just living on hope, on hope that someone will come to give them a choice, a better life, to be uplifted. We've only just reached half of our goal for the gala this year. And if we are not able to achieve all of it, 3,350 underprivileged youth and disabled youth like Pooja will not get the training they deserve. 45,000 babies and young mothers' lives will be impacted. 35,000 young children in our LAMP program will not get any education. These are large, large numbers. And AIF and all of you have the power to change one person's life 
completely and forever. We know we're working with an extraordinarily generous community and our plea to you today is that you extend yourselves to be the power that can change the face of this underprivileged community of every child and woman that needs your help today. Please be generous and thank you so much. <music>